viewers of Kim Wright, my name is Max, and I am with the last one in team here at Comic Con uh, London 2017. And we're going to play a quick game. So, the first thing I do is I'm going to deal ourselves some cards. So, this is the main deck. We both play from the same deck. I'm going to give us a three each. So, let's go back here. Then, this is a deck of buildings. So, I'm going to give us two each. Uh, five cards here. In the Right. So, the main basis of this game is to either save 35 people or flood your opponent with 70 zombies. So that's, so that's save 50 civilians. Uh, well, there's two versions. There's 35 civilians and 70 zombies. A quick version of the game. Or you can go 50 civilians. <laughs> Oh, so we'll go to the quick version just for now. Oh, <laughs> So you should have two uh, building cards and then three random cards from the main deck. I'm just going to put them, because this is a demo, I'm going to put them. So I'll show you mine as well. Um, okay, so one thing to take notice of first. A lot of these cards have perfect. This one is a 50. And because we're playing the quick version, we only need 30. Five people, so this would be ages. And it has the effect that I can discard it if I want to draw a new one. So I'm going to put it into the bottom of the deck somewhere. Ready? Yep. Uh, the first thing we're going to do is I want to play a building card. So the basis is we have to save 35 civilians. The only way we can do that is by filling up buildings. Yeah. So, so this is a 20. Um, essentially, and I'm going to play it on the field here. Play. Uh, now, so then I play the this. Game. It has the game. So I can either choose three cards from this main row. Yeah. Yeah. Or I can draw. So it's a land to play the game. Yeah. So you choose from there. Yeah. Or draw from there. Yeah. Six records. Okay. Understand the aim of the game. I'm going to choose three. Uh, follow the turn. Uh, so the I'll take this one. Process. Uh, I'll process. Instead of just choosing two like uh, this, and then you only take one at a time. And the you replace it. Might have something better than what is already in the field. So, so the take this. first place would consist of um, um, this. Playing the building from right. your hand. Um, you'll be using up the card, so you can choose um, okay. or draw cards. You choose cards, you can choose cards from the centre row. Uh, uh, these go straight into the hand. Uh, uh, cards of the top of the main deck. So with, with the decks, you'll have two, two uh, sets of decks. One's the main deck, right. one's the building deck. Next step is to save uh, So I'm going to take deck, so these two play, civilian cards, uh, civilian and I'm going to play it best into best my building. That's it. Uh, uh, step one phase, you have to play one civilian per turn. Okay. The last and phase the would be zombies. So I'm going to take four zombie cards, and I'm going to play it onto your field here. Now, you see, in your hand, you have this card, and it has uh, the effect uh, interrupt, which means when I play a card against you, if you like, I play this onto the card, both so of you get bounced back into my zombie play. Okay. Um, I wouldn't do it yet, just because this is a low card. If I were playing, let's say, this, which also has the same effect, you might want to bounce back because it's dangerous. Be fine for them. And the next step after that is a neutralization step. I don't have any neutralization cards in my hand at all. So the way it works, what a neutralization card is. During the turn phases, or during a turn your turn, there are six One of these, these are called defender lurkers. So, one effect allows you to play a building card. 
You then are talking now. You can go into the building. Oh, okay. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so then, the defender uh, allows you to kill zombies on your field. So if you're close to the max number, you can kill a few and you're safe there. Yeah. And the other side is a bit sneakier. And if I've got an open building, you then you could kill some of my people. It's not very nice, but if I close to away, he's got me down. But I'll put this back in there. I can't do anything. So, would be your goal. So, what I'd like you to do first is to play a building card. Okay. I'm going to play. And with regards to the building, uh, there's two crazy buildings. Okay. So put that down. Well, open building. The next step will be to save civilians. So you want to place some civilians into that building. Oh no, sorry, no. Uh, first, you want to either choose four from here, or you can draw two. It's up to you which one you want to do. Not draw two. Okay. So take two random cards from here. The final phase is uh, turn phase six. Okay. So let's go straight into our hand. The next phase is phase six. Um, now, you want to try and save some civilians. So, you've only got one civilian card. I'd say this. And play it to the On your side of the side. Next. Uh, Perfect. Um, yeah. Next is you want to play zombies against me. The rules of the game. So, so if some of the significant take this one to show you the play. So, if you play that against me, you put it on my field. Uh, we play mark, you only play one civilian card, so one zombie card. Also has the effect when dice roll. That means if. So, I roll this die, uh, and it lands on a 1, the a 3, or a 5, which is, oh, the, the uh, something called Lure activates, that, that and mixes, uh, the zombie of my choice in the centre row gets lured into my zombie pub. So it's kind of like this guy's a bit loud, he's crashing around, the zombies nearby hear it, smell him or something, and come and hide through some bad stuff. So I'll play this here, I'll have to roll the die. Okay, so three. That means I can choose. I'm going to take this one because this has another lure effect. So if I were to take this, this would end up in my hand anyway. So if I take this one, I can take four zombies, but it's not too bad. I will place the card. So now you want to play one of these cards. You know, have one of these cards so it's straight back to my turn. I'm going to choose three cards. One is this one. So I'm going to play three zombies against you. Uh, and you have this. So if you give this to me, I can read it. What sort of program do you have? So you take these two. Now I have. Well, I truly have a big place to this one. I didn't really want. I'm going to take this. So, uh, and then, uh, you've got a little bit, not that many buildings to play. Uh, so, uh, you've only got one building to play. Uh, uh, There's four civilians. So, uh, it's alright. So, what I'm going to do. Uh, I'm going to attack ten zombies from here. Oh, yeah. yeah. So, I'll take a five. Four, 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 five. Yeah, and if we run out of cards here, this gets recharged. Yeah, so that will be your go. So the first thing you do is either choose four or two. Well, I could invoke the developer role and say I'm still much fun to vote. Last one in the 
Okay. Okay. Is that how many did you draw? That's how many did you choose? You chose three. Yeah, I chose that one. You have one that extra. One. So that you can one. choose four. Oh yeah. In that case, I can relive my mistake. <laughs> I would choose one of these personally. I've never known how to count. Another ten. Yeah, yeah. Right. So now. B, um, your uh, saving civilian. So you want to try and fulfill this building up. So you've got four. You need uh, an extra six. So the highest equal card you have is you can play into this building. Unfortunately, it has to be exactly the right amount, but you can't go over. So, oh, yeah, you can only take. So, I play. Where are you? Yeah, yeah. So, there's nine. That's it. Wait until you get a one. You can use this one next turn and fill your bill. So, the next one, I think, be to attack. Okay. So, you want to take whichever zombie you like from your hand and play it against one. Okay, thank you. Um, uh, that's fine. Then we've got the So this card, you can either kill some of my people or kill some of the zombies that I've played against you. I'm doing a lot of PSVR videos. Okay, what I'm going to do... Are yeah, you allowed to pass? I think I'm going to pass for now. If you had more than six, you'd have to discard one, and then there's no cover zombie. So you just find the lowest card, and play it. What's the bucket? Oh, so now it's my card. I'm going to take the zombie and put it on my hand. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Uh, so I'm going to play 10 civilians into here because it's been up to 18. Uh, 17, sorry. Uh, I think I need three more to fill the bill, but I have to do that on my next turn. Uh, so I'm going to play four zombies against you. I'm going to play five zombies and then I'm going to defend against 10 zombies. So these both go into a dead pile there. So you're going to the first thing you'll do is either <coughs> draw two or choose four. Oh. Okay, so go ahead. Let me get with the drawing, I don't see where they are. I'm not allowed to see where they are. I did see two of the drawings. I'm just going to see if they're still there. I've got six months. Have a lure. Sorry. So if you play this against me, I have to take this zombie from the centre right. So let's say so, play this against me. Okay. Because of lure, I have to take this card. It's the only zombie in the centre. So I can't and it also has a dice, which is awful. Because now I have to roll a die. Right. So it's okay. I need to roll because there's no zombies in play. Now would be neutralization. So one of these two cards, either kill some of my people or kill some of your people. And then I don't know. 
So I can't do the the two more numbers. I'm going to lose Zerka. Ah, damn it. I will be on to my go. I'm going to choose the right time. I'm going to take him. I'm going to take him. I'm just going to carry on with that. Alright, baby. I'm going to take this. So, we're doing a 20, 30, 20. So, the first thing I'm going to do is play five splits into that. There. When I this against you, I do want to have to lower one of these. They're both the same. So if you take this, and then roll a die. Roll this d6. Oh no, so land on three. That means this gets lowered. So this goes into your hand. I'll put a card down. And you have to roll a die again because it's got the same effect. I know it gets tricky sometimes. Cool. Yeah, yeah, no, that's fine. Fine. So the roll of the die is if I match a number of zombies, then I have to pick them up. Well, if I don't. it lands on a one, or three, or a five, and uh, so that's okay. Now five zombies, I've got Zombies, just so they're out and fill the plate. Because I don't have too many in my hand. It only gets to 70 when I die. So if I take out that 20, unfortunately it was replaced by another 20. <laughs> but I could screw you over by not being able to draw that next time. Yeah. Um, 95. Then would be a neutralization phase. So either of these two cards. <laughs> And then this goes in with you. Okay, 
Uh, how many cars do you have in hand? Uh, loads. <laughs> I think I've buried myself. You said so? I think I've buried myself. <laughs> so, when you discard a card, try and get the lowest number cards in your entire hand. And they have to be discarded into a zombie pile, unfortunately. Okay. So. I Maybe we could just discard four zombies and five zombies. Where did these, where did these go? Are these, I think, are part of your zombies, aren't they? Huh? Are these in your hand or part of your zombies? Um, but you gave them to me as part of... I think they're just zombies in your zombie part. Yeah, so you should have part of those things in violation of my part of the food. So you've got two discards now. Discard a five seven. And the best you can do is another ten. But how will you maybe take the ten navigators because you've got two of them? Yeah. And then it's so I'm going to choose three. Take this one. 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 This So I've just ordered my hand. Huh? I've just ordered my hand. Uh, uh, so I can get uh, a bit. So I can get a bit. So Two civilians. This is 20. I've now filled up my entire hand. So this is safe. You can't touch it. Next step. And move. Zombies. I'm going to play this zombie against you. I've got to roll a die. Just like you put it in your hand, you don't have to play. Three. Unfortunately, it works. So, you've got to take one of the zombies from the centre right now. I need to just roll the dice now. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Is there any other one? Two. Yeah. Oh, that's that. Yeah. Uh, I'll place it with one of these. And then... Look, uh, I don't have any neutralization cards, so I just have to skip the turn. I've got yeah. seven cards in my hand, which is one, so I need to discard it. So I'm going to discard a single thing. A single thing again. Uh, I can't do that, I can't do that, so I'm just going to go against that. Let's have... How many, how many zombies do you have to attack me with before I die? Seventy. So how many is in there? <laughs> and it's not seventy yet. You have uh, thirty point five. Oh, uh, forty-six. So you're all right. You can leave that like that if you like. Now you know it. So, I can't play a building. Firstly, we play a building. So, what I can do is play something. No, no, no. It's my turn. It's your turn. What am I doing? Bloody hell. Okay. There you go. Uh, so, how many do you need to kill? Um, four, five, six, Along seven, two. eight. Do you have two? There isn't a two in here. That's so much. Do whatever you like. Either choose four or drop two. I'm going to choose. Four. I would, in your position, draw two, just because you've got quite a big hand. Yeah. Here. Also, if we just take two more cards. Oh, that's a tough news. So, you can't put any civilians into here, unfortunately. So, you have to go straight to attacking the zombies. Oh, no. Uh, now. I want to have a lot of blocks in the centre here. I couldn't, I couldn't really publish the buildings. Because you could screw me over with your long cards. I can't buy it, 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 I can't buy it. 
Now. Oh, wait, I'm going to the wrong card. That's wrong. No, that's the correct card. That's the correct card. Something I can do is I can play a lure against you on lure. Ah. And now, you get 10 tokens. Bring you up to, what was it? Um, 53 or something. 53 or something. Yeah. So you're, you're not too close. Well. Now would be your neutralization phase. So if you want to use this card to either. Um, I don't have any. This one on you? Are you redirected? Yeah. So the low effect on this one activates on yourself. So you would then have to choose another zombie from the center row, which would have to be the 20. Which then this alone activates, which would then mean you'd have to choose that. If that card is a zombie, you then have to choose that one as well. So it causes like a snowballing effect if you are lucky. Okay, so this goes to you unfortunately. So you might have actually just lost with this whole 20. Well, let's see what happens. Oh, luckily, so let's count this up quickly. And I'm afraid you've just lost, but it's a good game. Oh, yeah. oh sorry, we're la launching our Kickstarter on the 27th of June. And we've got our Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Uh, that's about it. Thank you very much for playing.